Hello there, 2Gen Beauties, and welcome back to the 2Gen Beauty and Lifestyle channel. Today, I am sharing a video with you uh, to unbox my new Influencer box. And it is the Fresca box box, I believe. Big orange box. Da -da, my info. Influencer's information. If you guys don't know what Influencer is, it is a kind of like a brand promotion company. They send out um, different themed boxes to people that qualify based on, you know, their demographic, their interaction on social media, and just uh, the types of products that they use. And if you qualify for a box, what they do is they send you a quiz in the email. And based on the way you answer the quiz questions, if you qualify, then you may be a recipient of a box. If you are, then you receive an email, possibly like a few weeks later, letting you know, hey, congratulations, you are going to be receiving this box and just be on the lookout for it in the mail. So I did receive the quiz. A couple of weeks later, I received the uh, email letting me know that the box was on the way and I literally got it like the next day. So it doesn't, once you get that email that it's being sent out, it does not take a long time. <clears throat> so. Just to give you an idea, everything that is falling out of the box. There is quite a bit in the box. This is the Fresca box box. Very cute theme. Everything that's in it is on the back of the card. And so basically, there's different um, tasks that you can do to become more of like an influencer, let's say, for each item. And they tell you what uh, the different tasks are. You can qualify for badges. Um, you know, they may have, uh, like I know one of the things in here is a Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Purifying Shampoo and Conditioner. Very cool. They may have a Not Your Mother's Badge. And if you're a badge winner, then uh, they may send you like a nice little gift uh, box or, bo or you know bag with more products from that company depending on what your interaction was with them. I have received uh, gifts before. I've been a badge winner for Vitabath which now I'm like a huge Vitabath fan. I became a Vitabath insider with Vitabath directly um, and I use their stuff all the time. So you do get introduced similar to like the subscription services but you're just not paying for the box. You don't get them every month. Shh. You don't, sorry. What is the problem? Come here. You don't get them every month, but um, you know they're pretty neat to receive. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and jump right in. Let's see what's going on in my box. And I will preface this: I don't know if everything is cruelty free in there. If there's something that's not cruelty free, I go. I don't really interact, and I let them know. Um, I I let influencer know directly. Hey. It's quite a shame that you guys are not sticking to cruelty-free products. Just so you're aware, this brand is not cruelty-free. Okay, so the first thing in here is the Pure Silk Rich and Luxurious Shave Cream. And I don't really know if they are cruelty-free or not. Oh, we do not test on animals. So I am very excited to try this out. It smells really, really good. I'm sorry, my dogs are like literally walking around me. And they're not little dogs either. They're big dogs. Stop it. Um, so this is in the, sh the flavor Raspberry Mist. And it's moisturizing with aloe. And it's a, a rust-proof can. So I've had shaving creams before in a metal can. And what happens? You have them in the shower because, what well, you're not going to keep them like in a cabinet because you're never going to remember to use it. Um, you put them in the shower and then when you go to, like after a certain amount of time, you see that little ring of rust. So that's very cool, a rust, a rust proof can. This is five ounces and the five ounce can retails for $1.49 and then there's also a larger can, an eight ounce can that retails for $2.19. So I will, um, and they do provide like all the different links to the social media for each of the brands. So I'll put those in the description box below as well, as well as the information for Influencer. So we've got Pure Silk. 
we've got <clears throat> the Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Purifying Shampoo and Purifying Conditioner. Ultra clean hair, retains natural moisture, improves manageability, sulfate, paraben, and dye-free for all hair types. And then the conditioner says moisturizes, smooths, and silkens, luxurious shine. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I'm excited to try this. Um, never tested on animals. So that's good hair. Hey, distributed from Tampa, which is down, you know, a couple of hours away from me. So I am excited to try both of these. Um, I've used Not Your Mother's brand before, and I've used their uh, dry shampoo. I can't remember what the name of it is because everything has like a cute name, but it is a really, really good dry shampoo, and it smells really, really good, very refreshing. So I'm glad that I received that. And this is one ounce for each. Uh, one ounce retails for $3, so this right here is $6. And the larger bottles are eight ounces and retail for seven dollars each. All right, so the next thing in here is there's a few items from a brand called Jofra. So there's the Jofra blends, number one in the fragrance Violet Pomegranate. Sounds, sounds yummy. Number two in the fragrance Seesaw and oops, Seesaw and Rose Petals. And number three in the fragrance or the scent, Blackberry Juniper Magnolia. So you've got, you know, three little vials that you can go ahead and kind of mix and match your scents so you can blend them. And I'm not going to open them and tell you what, well, I, you know, with fragrances. Let me just influence her. Tell your brands, tell your brands that you prefer the little sprays. Same amount of liquid. You know, same amount of packaging. Okay, this one, okay, so a little better. This one is a twist off. That smells lovely. This is in Seesaw and Rose Petals. It smells very good. So this one twists off, but you know the ones that you kind of have to like try and like push it off? I hate those. I'm not a big fan of fragrance samples, but if I'm gonna get one, fine. Make sure there's a decent amount of product in there and put it in like the little spray that you know, you can, like a normal person. That's it. That's all I asked for. Is that too much? All right, this is Violet Pomegranate. Oh, it smells really good. It's a little bit stronger than the Sea Salt and Rose Petals. And then this one is the Blackberry Juniper Magnolia. And these are each uh, 0.3 full ounces. Oh, smells good, too. I think probably that one's like the lightest scent out of all of them. And it doesn't smell fruity like you would think, blackberry, but it does not smell fruity. They're all very um, florally to me. And they also sent a full size um, of one fragrance. So I got it in Violet Pomegranate, which of the three, I'm glad it was that one because I love the smell of violets. So it came in the little box. Let me show you the box first. You can see. And it is. This is the actual bottle and comes with a spray top. We already know what it smells like, but I, oh, it's very refreshing. I really, really like this violet pomegranate. It doesn't really say, oh, okay, one full ounce. And this brand, let's see, $22. This is the retail value. This is a full size, one ounce. Retail price is $22. And it also came with kind of like a card talking about the actual brand. So you've got English on one side and Spanish on the other. The next thing in here is the Sally Hansen Airbrush Legs. Water resistant, smooth on, perfect legs in an instant. So it's kind of like a leg makeup. Um, I don't know. Water resistant. I don't know if it smudges. I've never tried a, a product like this before. Apply sparingly to knees and ankles. Okay, squeeze a quarter size of product into the hand. Smooth on evenly to legs and feet. Rub in completely. Remove easily with soap, water, and a washcloth. And I, I, was re I received it in the shade medium. Let's see. 
It seems a little dark, but um, we will try that out. I guess that's the point, right? Airbrush legs. So it kind of has a little bit of a, a shade to it. And then there was also a $2 coupon in there. Um, I want to say that Sally Hansen is not a cruelty-free brand. I'm not 100% sure, but I will put that in the um, description box below. The next thing in here is the NYC Expert Last Lip Lacquer in the color Rock uh, Rockaway Ruby. Doop, doop, doop. Okay, so it's kind of, oh, it smells good. So it is a doe foot applicator. Um, let's see. Just to kind of spread it out. Very bright pigmented red, so I'm excited to try that. I don't know, lately I've been getting like all of this red stuff. That's fine. So I'm taking off this huge sticker. And I am a big fan of NYC. I've received um, some of their products before from Influencer, and I, I really do like it. And I've actually uh, purchased um, from the drugstore. You can get this at like CVS or Walgreens. And they are, uh, I do know that they are cruelty free. And let's see what else. The last item in here is the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Boosters Facial Cleanser, White Tea and Vitamin E. And this is oh, 5, 0.5 ounces. And I'm sorry, I did not tell you the price for the NYC. NYC Expert Last Lip Color. So this product retails in the drugstore for $3.99. So about four bucks. They are, all of their products are very reasonably priced. Um, and they're very, very good. So, okay, let's see. Neutrogena. This one, um, full size, this is half an ounce. Full size is 4.2 ounces and retails for $8. So I'd say this is probably like, I don't know, a dollar's worth. And like, I'm, this is another brand. I'm not quite sure what um, their cruelty free status is, but I will go ahead and put that information in the description box below. And that is it. There is nothing else in my box. So I did receive quite a bit and I will uh, just let you know how everything works out and I will let you know uh, what the social media outlets are for each of them. Uh, I will let you know the status of the Sally Hansen and the Neutrogena um, as whether they are cruelty free because that's going to be a factor as to whether I interact with them socially. If they are not, I will not put the social media links um, in the description box So just so that you are aware. So if you are an influencer, um, let me know. Put, your, put a you know, comment in the box and let me know what you think of Influencer, what boxes have you received, what have been your favorite products, and um, I hope to hear from you soon. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and share it with all your besties, and I hope you have a great afternoon.